Hi, it's Apple 1975 and welcome to Elite Dangerous on the Xbox One. And that only clip was me having fun in my travel clipper. Um, as usual, I bombed up somewhere to get involved in some fighting and winged around in my clipper until my actual combat ship arrived. Uh, my clipper is stupidly fast, so I was able to get myself into and out of a lot of trouble very, very quickly. Uh, I nearly died about three times. Uh, Keep It Tidy nearly got me a couple of times. Unfortunately for Tidy, I think chasing after me in a straight line got him killed because I know he died a couple of times on the day. So I took a break from BGSing on achieving the rank of King with the Empire. I felt I deserved it. I think I made King in like two days. So I'm a bit of a worry. Um, so I um, decided to join in some PvP fighting. I got rewarded with three kills or, you know, being part of three kills. Um, I think the, the guys I was flying with got five or six kills on the day for one loss. Um, and that was in this instance. Uh, this was the one instance that IED will claim victory in because they chased us all out. Um, though we did get a kill on a Corvette. Or, well, I didn't, but I did. Uh, I turn up when its drives are dead and, you know, participate in shooting a, you know, basically a static target. Uh, yeah, Crimson had done all the work and I helped him claim his kill, which probably lucky I did because the rest of the instance we weren't aware because the fight got quite fractured and spread out over like 30 kilometers and um, we didn't realize this but Ragnar Scott was leading the charge and this massive wave of IED ships and their allies appear and um, I'm seeing all the low wakes from all of our allies as they've all jumped back uh, one system away to regroup. So yeah, this was the one instance that IED won, and unfortunately IED disappeared off after this, which was a bit of a shame, because uh, I was quite enjoying the celebration of becoming king. Um, yeah, I'm now a king in the empire. Um, who would have thought IED space is really, really good for rank grind? It's really good for rank grind, to be honest. Um, you know, I jumped from prince to king in like two days, so, you know, um, yeah, not that I'm running a lot of missions, just... Honestly, um, um, I'm sure I'm doing something else with my time. But I had fun winging in and out of uh, combat because it made a nice change of pace from the BGS I've been doing. And um, yeah, so, <laughs> you know, this is definitely, definitely, definitely not my kill um, because, you know, you can't claim credit for something where its drivers have already been taken out uh, by the time you turn up. But. It's always gratifying to see something big go pop, uh, especially when it's player owned. And um, yeah, the uh, salute as always to those guys. They they always take their deaths well. They're a fun group to fight against. Um, I don't think even IED even acknowledged them as allies. To be honest, I don't know why they always roll out for IED. Um, to be honest, boys, you'd make more money joining our side. Um, <laughs> and if you if you want to make good money. Uh, it's still 100 million for an IED ally, 200 million for IED, and 500 million for Fall at War. Contact the Seventh Legion. Make yourself a bucket load of money. I know that um, Nightfall Saul is uh, looking to get a fleet carrier very, very soon. He's saving up massive amounts of money um, from his huge amount of kills, uh, which is probably why he's being focused quite heavily by IED at the moment, because uh, he is one hell of a deadly combat. But here comes Ragnar Scott and the rest of the fight um, as they found us out on this fringe killing Corvettes. And um, yeah, we're soon very, very, very heavily outnumbered. And as you can see from all those white dots, that's all the guys that were on our side uh, waking out of here. Um, you know, we, I don't think me and Crimson have really become aware of how much the rest of the fight was going. Um, I'd already been like forced out to the edge once and gone out and reboot and repaired. Um, so I was pretty sure it was pretty nasty. And there's uh, Ragnar in, you know, hitting me with a nice plasma ram. I, I should pull out of these rams because the plasma rams do more damage to me. But hey, you know, I didn't in this case. And um, I nearly pay the price. Look at the amount of ships. So it was basically uh, a pretty one-sided fight. But IED do like to claim an instance. And as soon as they claim the instance, they disappeared off. And I went back to BGSing. But, you know, it was a nice break. Anyway, that's all. Thank you very much for watching.